Earth bending is pretty fing OP. In theory, Earth will cover the whole periodic table, dude. Air bending can control the oxygen we're breathing, but I don't think it's like at that scale. Cause like if you're an air bender, you bend the air around you. Just like water bending, you bend the water around you. It's not like you're looking at a freaking stone and then like ta-da, water comes out, right? I guess you could like, yeah, you can probably control the humidity humidity of stuff if you're a waterbender. But if you're an airbender, you wouldn't be in the water and then suddenly like, I don't know, like bend like like, like air out of nowhere. Unless you fart. Can you can you bend the fart if you're an airbender? <laughs> see, see, that's what I'm talking about. You gotta generate what you bend. But earth, earth's everywhere. Fart bending. I I I bend your farts and make them into burps. So like <laughs> just reverse engineer it, you know? <laughs> Play on. Think about it, bro. Think about it. Think about it. Flayon, don't, don't don't leave me on this one. Don't leave me on this one, Flayon. If you are an airbender, you technically could be like, whew, you can generate the air that, that you can bend from that. But you're in the water and you're drowning. You're you're fucking dead. But he, here's what happens. When you discombulate, when you die, when you just like, when you release everything inside of you, you fart. And you can probably control those like glass, like breathing farts, you know? There's oxygen in water, but like it's air bending, not oxygen bending. You heard a smoke in the water? You heard a fart in the water? Oh my god, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh!